environmental modelling is representing the system in a way that you can actually play with it without hurting the system itself. We model the environment so that we can do a sensitivity studies on it without actually going out and putting lots of chemicals straight in the ground to gain knowledge about either the future or potential problems in the case of, say, a sea level rise. What we're trying to do essentially is recognise all of the different components of a system and then try and recognise how those different components interact, what aspects outside that system might impact that system and how those forcings control the system over different time scales and different spatial scales. The UK is really worried about being competitive in an international sense and has done an audit through different industries to work out what skills it really needs to emphasise to build up its capabilities and the top one of those for the environment sector is modelling. We're a natural home for uh, an MSc in environmental modelling uh, given that we have one of the largest and most diverse uh, groupings of environmental science uh, and environmental modelling uh, researchers uh, in the UK and we also uh, have one of the best technical computing facilities of any geography department. We have very large numbers of Linux-based uh, technical workstations and rack-based computing, uh, which allows us to run the latest uh, computer uh, simulations of climate change, ocean dynamics, and hydrological system behaviour. Environmental modelling is particularly relevant to climate change research, which is a, a major topic at the moment. The course is very good if you wanted to go into a PhD because it gives you the practical skills that are particularly needed in environmental modelling PhDs. I think that all the key skills I've learned in this Masters will apply. These skills are in short supply and they're demanded by a wide range of employers uh, from uh, consultancies uh, working on particular uh, projects uh, as well as uh, agencies uh, concerned with management and uh, environmental policy. The broad nature of this environmental modelling MSc programme will give you the flexibility to stay right at the forefront of the sector as environmental problems grow and hopefully some are fixed, but you need that flexibility to stay with where the field is going.